So I've stayed in the studio as long as I can. Normally I would stay till my rag came and dragged me out. But unfortunately for the second weekend in a row, I'm having RSD attacks. R RSD, I have RSDs here, yes, which means I'm kind of having these weird neurological seizures where it feels like my brain is being electrocuted and I can't quite see. And I've lost feeling inside my face and it's just oh, such a dumb illness. So, we're, unfortunately, I have to throw in the towel and just go home. I've, um, the illness and whatever storm is coming that's affecting this has caused me to just like fall asleep. I'm standing there, and as I said to a friend of mine last week, you know those kids you see and they're trying to eat a hot dog and they're just falling asleep? Well, that's what happens to me when I'm having attacks is I'm like painting and I'm falling asleep like wow the hot dog's great and I just you know I just want to keep painting and I'm doing this and falling asleep and then I lay down to try and sleep and because my brain is having electrical impulses I can't quite sleep it's just this weird psychedelic mess and I wake up exhausted and I'm still having these weird seizures. So we're going to call it a day. And it's really sad because now I can't get back in here until next weekend. Um, I'm a little frustrated because that means I'm going to lose all this paint that I've laid out. It's all going to dry. All the time I took setting up and cleaning off my milk glass wasn't really wasted, but. You know, it didn't last as long as I was hoping it would. So, off we go. And my phone is ringing in my pocket, so I'm holding it. But, you know, I get really upset with this because I spend so much time going back and forth from my apartment to my studio when really, if I... If, if, if the United States actually took artists seriously, okay, it's stop ringing. If the United States started taking artists seriously and our contributions to the culture seriously, I wouldn't be in this position. You know, I would be able to focus on the work. Um, if, you know, our culture didn't see the arts as just being some big coloring project that stupid children do, but actually sees the value in it. I could be here and I could be doing my life's work without having to wait an entire week to spend just a few hours painting. It's it's kind of it's it's humiliating and it's embarrassing that our culture is like this because without artists we wouldn't have apple products and beautiful cars and beautiful homes and interior design and beautiful clothing. We wouldn't be known for how our culture looks, you know, and artists define what our culture looks like, but instead of being valued, we're just treated like nuisance, stupid little children. And I get very upset, I get very, very frustrated. And there we are. I see the value in what I do. Why doesn't everybody else? Damn it. Anyway, I've got to check my phone, and I think my ride is here, so I've got to get downstairs. What a shame. What a shame. Ciao.